Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. NetCDF, Network Common Data Form, is a file format commonly used for array-oriented scientific data, particularly in meteorology, oceanography, and other fields. To work with NetCDF files in Python, you can use the NetCDF4 library, which provides tools for reading and writing NetCDF files. Below is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to open a NetCDF file in Python, along with code examples. Step 1, Install Required Libraries First, you need to install the NetCDF4 library if you haven't already. You can install it using pip. Open your terminal or command prompt and run. Step 2, Import the library. Once you have installed the library, you can import it into your Python script or Jupyter Notebook. Step 3, Open a NetCDF file. To open a NetCDF file, you can use the dataset function from the NetCDF4 library. You need to provide the path to your NetCDF file and the mode in which you want to open it, example R for read. Step 4, Explore the dataset. Once you have opened the NetCDF file, you can explore its contents. You can view the dimensions, variables, and attributes of the dataset. 4.1 Check Dimensions You can check the dimensions of the dataset using the dimensions attribute. 4.2 Check Variables You can check the variables available in the dataset using the variables attribute. 4.3 Access a specific variable To access a specific variable, you can use its name as a key. For example, if you want to access a variable called temperature, you can do so as follows. Step 5, Close the data set. After you are done with the data set, it is a good practice to close it to free up resources. Complete example Here's the complete code combining all the steps. Conclusion This tutorial provided an overview of how to open and explore a NetCDF file using Python's NetCDF4 library. You can further manipulate the data as needed for your analysis. If you have specific questions or need help with more advanced features, feel free to ask.